Today is October the 17th and there's a frost advisory tomorrow. Stan pulled up the rest of the pepper plant. So now there's nothing, there's nothing left in the garden. Um, tomatoes on the ground and, and some peppers on the ground. Put everything in a big pile and eventually when that dries off, that will get burned. Oh, my basil is pulled up too. Yeah, see, that's the, that's the end of the garden. Nothing left there. It's all completely gone. And even the soybean field has been combined and the ground has been worked up. So that's it. I'd say that is a final, a final, final farewell to my Indiana garden for this season. I don't know if dill is um, frost hardy. I know the sage over here, the sage will still be fine after the frost, but I picked uh, a nice bunch of dill and I'm going to freeze that. Here's the dill that I just picked. I rinsed it off in some water, patted it dry, and then put its stems and all on this uh, soil patch sheet again. I'm going to stick it in the freezer and then once it's frozen, um, I'll put it in probably either probably Ziploc bags or maybe some small jars. Uh, once it's frozen, the leafy part should come off really easy and I won't use the stems. I won't use the stems. There were a few little brown dried up. I picked them off. We'll throw those away. Is there any more I missed here? Hmm. Oh well, that looks pretty good. So now I can still have some fresh dill for a cream cheese dip or yogurt dip for the winter.